What's going on guys? T-Mart here and today I'm here to tell you guys that our prayers have been answered, baby. There's a huge patch coming to Call of Duty Advanced Warfare in the next couple of days. This is very, very exciting. So, uh, check this out. Last Saturday, the 29th, Michael Condry tweeted this. Hashtag Advanced Warfare title update for the Xbox One, PlayStation 4, PC. Stay tuned for notes including weapon balancing, ranked play updates, map exploits and spawn fixes, optimizations, and more. Then he went on to say this. Somebody asked him, I know you probably won't answer this, but is there a time frame to when we're gonna get the patch? And he replied, waiting for first party approval, but expecting some time in the coming week. Now keep in mind, this was on the 29th, which was a couple of days ago. So uh, yeah, within the next couple of days, we are gonna get a huge new title update to Advanced Warfare on the next gen consoles and the PC. Now, uh, two of the biggest things in that list to me are the weapon balancing and the map exploits. You guys know there's like a, a big exploit on the map uh, Horizon and there are a few others where people are getting these like, you know, spots where you can't shoot them and stuff like that. That stuff's gonna be fixed, which is gonna be nice. Now, uh, on the other side of things, weapon balancing, this is huge because for the most part, a lot of the weapons are kind of underpowered compared to assault rifles. Like there's the Ball 27, which kind of like is the king of everything. Then you've got other assault rifles like the HBR, the AK-12, the IMR, things like that that are really, really solid. And then you have everything else below that. You know, SMGs need a buff. Shotguns aren't too bad. They might be able to use a slight buff. Uh, the, the, you know, heavy weapons aren't really all that great, that kind of thing. So I, I think a, a weapon balancing was, you know, long overdue at this point. Now, if you guys don't know, they already have put up a patch on the previous gen consoles, the Xbox 360 and the PlayStation 3. It's been live for about a week and a half, two weeks now. And they did do some weapon balancing there. And I'm curious to see how it transfers over. So uh, the Battle 27 was definitely nerfed in terms of recoil on the previous gen consoles. It's got a lot more recoil now. I, I put up a video about it for you guys. And, and it's not quite as dominant as it used to be. It's still one of the best weapons in the game, but it's not like extremely overpowered. It's not a laser rifle, which is nice. Now, uh, on the other side of things, they did buff some of the heavy weapons. And the EM1 is just absolutely insane. I put up a video about this. I think it's like the best gun in the game on the previous gen consoles now because you don't have to reload. It kills extremely quickly. It's just like, it, it, it has insane hip fire. It, it's nuts. It's an absolutely insane gun. So I'm interested to see just how, you know, this transfers over to the next gen. Is the EM1 still gonna be this like, you know, godly weapon that nothing else can touch? Or are they gonna scale it back a bit? I, I hope they do. And then also I hope to, uh, to see a, a little bit of an SMG buff. Like, yeah, as of right now, there's not really any reason to use SMGs in this game because the assault rifles will beat them out in just about every situation. So uh, that would be nice to have a little bit more uh, diversity there. Now, uh, another kind of like final thing I want to mention to you guys, you wouldn't have seen it from these tweets, but if you guys saw today's earlier video, you might have caught this. One of the things that they're changing with ranked play is they're, you know, kind of like updating, improving the skill-based matchmaking. And I hope that that's kind of like a, a system-wide update across you know all the public playlists the rank playlists that kind of thing because you guys know skill-based matchmaking while it is fun and it does you know help increase the competitiveness of the game at times it also you know leads to you getting in some pretty bad lobbies in terms of connection and stuff like that and I would like to see the connections be a little bit more favored towards you know finding a good host where you have a good connection all your bullets are connecting and things like that uh, rather than you know playing with people that are you know specifically you know right around your skill level like I, I would rather have priority on connection rather than skill level just to make it a more enjoyable experience across the board so uh, yeah there you guys have it Big new patch coming to Advanced Warfare sometime this week within the next couple of days. Very exciting. When it does drop, I'll be sure to let you guys know. And, uh, and thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you all later. Check out these two videos. See you yet. Peace out, guys.